Hello YouTube, today on Details and Dioramas, I have from Lion Roar the M16 Anti-Aircraft Motor Carriage Detail Set. This is kit number LAS35012, as you can see up here, and is for the Dragon series. So this is a super detail conversion series. Looking around the box, pretty plain uh, boxing. No real additional information, they just... Uh, do the sticker on the front here with that. So we'll look at the instruction sheet and then go from there. Now this is primarily a photo etch sheet uh, set, so we're not going to see too much in the way of resin, if any. And so, actually looking, I don't believe there is any resin in, in this. So, taking a look here, building the surround for the fan blades. Putting those on, replacing out uh, some of the bracing with the photo etch bracing to give a more scale look to it. Continuing on down, replacing pretty much all of the flooring and tick plates and steps, adding uh, PE detail to those just to give it additional information. It does show to use uh, some 0.3 mil copper wire for some of the additional details for what looks like a hose clamp. Going down through again, adding interior detail to the actual driver's compartment. Building up little boxes, hand grabs. And then our dashboard and then building up the seats seat backs all of that continuing on uh, I believe yep to the outside now so uh, we're gonna be working um, basically replacing all of the strapping and all of the uh, parts that were originally molded into the jerry cans, adding those to, or adding them in with photo etch for some additional detail. Again, cutting off this front part, showing you what to remove so that you can later replace it. Front windscreen, armor plating. Slides for the armor plating on the windscreen. The actual front hood, which is entirely comprised of photo etch. So it can actually be bent up or set up in a, in a way to display it open. or uh, structure sheet number two here. Continuing on into the rear section, we have our ammo cartridges, or all of our ammo tins getting put in. Putting some buckets into place. Additional armor shielding for around the gun mount. Putting up some cages for the jerry cans. Actually, I can kind of I can apologize. It looks like I might have hopped around. So, looking here, putting the front hood on, building up the ammo cans, and then radio compartment, getting that all built up, building up the ring and the 50 cal which has a metal barrel so you'll be cutting off the kit barrel for so set the instructions out of the way and let's look at what we can get in the actual set here yeah. it's nicely protected and padded so we have here let me go ahead and just pull these off first have our four 
barrels for the quad anti-aircraft. As you can see, it's just absolutely superb. Let's go ahead and let's get these kind of broke apart here. So go ahead and actually I'll show you this and then I'll stick those back on. So starting here with fret B, you can see all of the diamond plate. Have our dashboard there. See all of the little detail pieces. Go ahead and reattach those barrels just so I don't lose them. On the reverse side here, which is fret A, some of the larger pieces. So we have our fans. Again, just trying to call it out when I see something that I, I definitely know the, what it is. So like these here are gonna be for our actual engine compartment, uh, the covers over the engines. Have our decal there for the speedometer, tachometer, and I'm assuming probably temperature and or voltage. On the reverse side, more detail for the internals. So like this is going to be more of the gun detail. We have some of the, the boxes for the ammo cans here. That would be on sprue D. And then lastly, sprue C. So as you can see, a lot of photo etch in this set. So um, again, it's definitely a, uh, a kit for an experienced modeler or somebody who will be basically building this project as a long-term competition model. Um, this will definitely enhance the original M16 as those are... They're great models to begin with, but this just adds that extra level of realism uh, with the you know, super thin sheet metal, all of the additional bracing, um, the metal barrels, all of that will just really make this a, you know, award-winning model. You know, it'll just take time to do. So hope you've enjoyed. Uh, look into the Lion Roar M16 Super Detail Set for um, the... Dragon models.